hi lovely welcome back to my page so today i decided to uh to deal with my spice trolley for a long time i have been procrastinating i'm not sure i've ever cleaned this trolley for more than once <laughs> since i got it and it's more than two years already so this weekend i decided to give it um a thorough clean normally i just used to bring out the spices arrange them but i never really had the time to clean the uh the trolley so what i did was to uh empty all the stuff inside everything inside i strongly believe that some of the things might have expired especially those ones that i didn't actually refill myself the ones that i bought directly from shops um so i decided to give the trolley a thorough clean of its life this is one item that i've been procrastinating to clean another item is there i mean another um what's it called there's another tray that, I, that i've been meaning to clean so i gave it a very very good clean by using sponge and, and soap to clean i i think this thing if it has a mouth it will be praying for me i'm very you can imagine the uh, amount of dust, amount of dirty that's accumulated in this thing. I used to put my onions inside as well. So it has accumulated so much dust and dirty. But then, today is the day, right? So I washed. I didn't just dust this time around. I washed thoroughly to remove all the, um, the grease, all the onion spills and all those powdered stuff powdered spice stuff that has um eaten up the the trolley see the way i was very very serious with the thing <laughs> Then I realized that I, the inside was not getting cleaned thoroughly, so I got this my kitchen brush. Oh my god, this brush has been a lifesaver. Like, I use it to wash anything in this kitchen. So I got this brush and used it to clean the inside as well, not just the body. Then I wiped it with, um, with cloth. Okay, now, you know by now, I don't like leaving um, my space dirty. I love to clean on the go. Like, I don't want to come back to doing all these things not even in the afternoon so i wiped with uh, dried uh, napkin before putting the spices inside again i've been meaning to buy another trolley like this so that i can be using to store my fruit but i'm not sure if i'll get a space to keep the thing so i loaded my onions that used to be at the very top there uh these are my salt uh, container and then I started looking at the expiry date of all these spices that's my turmeric I think that turmeric already expired uh, it's, expired, it's expired already then I've got this rosemary uh, container which is which has finished and I've not really even remember to to buy another one or fill it up then I have this jollof rice mix that I got from uh, Manchester I think it's finished even before I used the thing I'm not used to all these extra spices jollof rice mix this soup mix spices at all then I put this my this maggi I'm not sure if this maggi had expired because it's been a very long time I had this particular Mr. Chizzy Mr. Chelf Abi Mr. Watsef then my um my snow seasoning so i have this mayonnaise container i'm a very good hiko champion like i hardly throw away all my containers i must find a very good use of it i'm not sure i've ever thrown away any mayonnaise container before i always the jar i always keep it because i know that i'll have something to use it to use them for so i've had this washed before uh with the intention of putting my spices inside or cream or whatever so it really comes handy the same thing with my honey um jar i have this honey jar as well so that's my uh paprika that i poured inside that honey jar instead of me buying from shops 
at very expensive price i prefer to just buy the big bag and refill the the jar which is very economical right so that is my uh, my grounded no uh seasoning that my sister sent to me one time like that and then i've got these empty jars which would be useful later though you will see a vi another video of me making use of the empty jar then this is a very big bag of um is it curry curry is this one right yes this is a very big bag of curry and as you can see it's very very economical to buy this thing in bag and then refill instead of buying the small small ones and tada my jar is ready oh sorry my spice trolley is ready then this is the space where i used to keep the trolley i cleaned it properly as well before returning the trolley only god knows when i am ever going to <laughs> to clean that trolley but as you can see it's looking so perfect looking so charming looking so clean tell me what is that one thing that you have been longing you have been procrastinating to clean in your kitchen maybe this is the time to get a hold of it maybe this is the time to carry it and give it a very good wash and you'll be satisfied just like i am satisfied after drinking this water <laughs> Don't forget to like my videos, share and follow this page. Bye-bye.